Sick ones already today. Wardo. Nice turn. Getting under me. Ryan's a shredder. He's been killing it for a long time. Dane, watch this little turn. Saw that corner setting up Thanks. for Dane Cameron in the red. Riders 7.40 on the clock. Billy Howie coming in, firing out of the gates with a 7.4 and then lights it up for a front side fan. He has to punch his ticket off the lift out into the flats. Cool line, treacherous maneuver. 7.20 on the clock. Yeah, Ryan Ward. Got some speed. Hey, nice. Steezy nice. way back on the tail. Showing great off. control. Yeah, Billy. Woo. See you later. Following that Johnny Salsa line. All right, riders. If I could get a few professional riders while we're on break, going into the amateur division, I'm going to need... Judges for the AMs 12 to 14 and amateurs 15 to 17. So we have one hour of judging. I need five judges. Please report. I need three judges. Three judges to step up for the AM 12 to 14. Personal favorite division. These kids light it up. They're light. They're smaller than all these legs. Everything's like overhead high on these guys. And they rip. Dane Cameron, three shove out. Yeah, three shove out to a wrap. Finding the sunshine, fast fit barrels from Dane Cameron. Thank you, Joey. Right down the front, Billy H. Priority to Ryan Ward. In the catbird seat. Little set up here. Gonna have to have it up. Okay. Again, riders, I'm gonna need three volunteer judges, preferably from the professional division, to come and take over the reins for some of these guys to be hand in five and a half minutes. And right now in the water, we've got Billy Howie out in first place. Rider in white, Dane Cameron in second. And Ryan Ward not far behind, knocking on the door. Ryan Ward in third place. And the waves are still just smacking here at Aliso Beach State Park. 
We got five minutes on the clock, guys. Five minutes. Mine? 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 Mine, 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 mine. No, it's very important. Right? It's got another shot. Very, very important. Anytime they ask, we shall give you the digits. Right so now, the rider in red is priority, Dane Cameron. I was saying noticeably absent as we watch Dane go straight down in front. professional riders that just couldn't make the trip this year. Sammy Sinette celebrating honeymoon, wedding bliss over in the island. Defending champion Johnny Weber isn't with us this weekend. And then, of course, Blair is coming off an injury. So we wish all those guys, if you're hurt, a speedy recovery. And looking forward to seeing them next year. Billy can't concede on that floater. Nice backhand floater. But this is still an incredibly stacked professional division with riders from all over the globe competing here on the slopes of Aliso. That cash purse will announce all the winners at our award ceremony tomorrow afternoon on the beach. Stick around for that. Two full days to win all of our finals tomorrow. And right now we've got 3.30 on the clock. Uh, uh, we're 3.30 on the clock. Billy Howie out in first place, 19.47. Dane Cameron in second, 16.66. Ryan Ward in third, 15.86. So it, again, is a tight battle, particularly between second and third. Dane Cameron, oh, yeah, nice, crispy, clean. I uh, think he clapped his hands. I think he clapped his hands on the way down on that. <laughs> I like the little adjustment he did, too. You saw the little pivot on the way up, three turns, I like the way I was like, oh, pivoted, oh, and no. then he threw to the turn. It's a little setup. It's like loading the hammer. <laughs> Very smooth, Ryan Ward going for the backside. 360 air. Dane Cameron looking to create a little bit of a cushion in second place. Yeah, beautiful turn, beautiful section. You know, he did a good job. He, he, he probably admit it wasn't his smoothest drop, but he was able to finish that wave, and it's always about completion of ride. Good job there, Dane. And what you don't want to do, especially with 220 on the clock, is take a wave that could... Oh, yeah. my goodness. Tell you what, Billy Howie. Billy Barrel Howie's been getting it done in this heat and this morning. He's having a great competition. Dude, that's two bombs. Full-on bombs. Right in the middle of the contest area. Ryan getting steep with it. Very critical section. Two minutes on the clock, riders. Two minutes on the clock. Yeah, and again, not to be underdone, two minutes on the clock, you don't want to have a fall. You, if, if, if you can, bring it back up to the beach because it saves you a hike through deep water. Yeah, and driving, covering a lot of ground on that route. Lots of speed. Now the rider in white, Billy Howie with priority. Minute 30 on the clock. As it stands, Ryan Ward is the man on the bubble. Matthew. One wave can change it. We've seen it happen already today several times. No one's safe until that final buzzer. Just as recently as that last heat, Garrett Abdullah turned the heat with five seconds left. With Jackie oh, Howie did it in his seat. So we've seen it done. One minute, Ryan Ward looking to do, looking to follow in those footsteps. Gets out to a nice one. Oh! Just <laughs> caught an edge. Had to walk off of it. Pretty choppy down there on the re-entry. Yeah, lots of little waves. All that texture really converts in that in that section. And it's been interesting work. We've seen different riders throughout different sections, uh, segments of the day utilize different peaks along the beach. And that was a big money spot for Gerardo and for Johnny Salsa. And now it's proving to be a little more difficult with guys like Mike Chapman and Ryan Ward in that Matthew. same section uh, struggling to get a clean open face there. 20 seconds on the clock, riders. 20 seconds. All right, this is it. Final go for these guys. I can do it in a second, actually. Ryan yeah, looking right. to get something. He's got a little camera line jib. I expect some kind of air move. He'll just head. There it is. Nine. 
eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. <laughs> that is going to do it. And it looks to me like on that last wave, Ryan Ward was looking for something, had to force a four. And it doesn't look like it's going to do it. So moving on, we're going to have and advancing Billy Howie in first place.